Is there anything you're reading at the moment that you enjoy? Um, yes, I'm reading a book called Shantaram and it's about this Australian guy who escapes from prison and he goes to India and starts a new life so there. Was it was it gory enough for you, Kevin? Or... It was really nice, like, it was really scary. And... If you've got eight children in a class, you might have eight different formats. They all have a different need and that's our job and that's part of the, the challenge of being a teacher. Um, of visually impaired children, but it makes me even want to do it even more because they need that. My name's Caroline Walker. Um, I work for RNIB Bookshare. We're a key link between a publisher having a mainstream title that can't be read by somebody who has a print impairment, uh, and by using the electronic files on Bookshare, they can transcribe them into a different format or use them electronically in audio, in large print, in braille, or however they need to use them. My name is Mary Ellen Flynn and I'm a teacher here. I teach English at Priestley Smith. I was able to contact the RNIB Bookshare and request titles that I needed. But then also with the 30,000 titles that they already have, I was able to immediately download a text that day and I nearly danced. It was just really good to be able to do that. So I, I really like the ease of it for myself. We want educators to be able to spend their time with learners teaching, not be having to spend time being on the phone to publishers, you know, to spend time transcribing resources. And it's, what's really great is that you can add your learners to the site uh, and they can be accessing resources directly themselves. My name is Yusuf. Uh, I'm 17 years old. I'm currently studying A-levels in music technology and ICT. The tapestry showed a lion being hunted. The snarling face had given... Yusuf has been at our school for a long time. He's, he's blind um, and he's very capable. He has a high amount of curiosity. Um, and the only thing stopping him from satisfying that curiosity is um, the ability to find Braille text. One of my kids signed me up to be... Uh, the uh, the bookshare itself and she put some books on there um, which were related to what I was studying. It gives me a, a list of file types that I can choose from. Um, so there's PDFs and um, uh, various other file types. Uh, so you click on it and then you click on download and um, it then downloads it onto the device. If you're not interested and excited it's not gonna um, you're not gonna really want to read. I go into a different world because I like I not feel like I'm there with the characters. But once you give that choice to a child, then they're going to be a lot more interested. And their growth in being able to recognize words, to learn vocabulary, it happens when they don't even realize it, when they're lost in a book. Thanks to Priestley Smith Specialist School. RNIB. See differently.